Many have asked the question, is there life outside of our planet? Various space agencies have done a great job at discovering new planets, some of which have a lot of things in common with Earth, meaning that we know other planets exist out there that could potentially hold complex life. It's these discoveries that have caused us to explore certain regions more. Some of the most fascinating discoveries are those of asteroids. These large rocky bodies are interesting for a number of reasons. One, because they have the ability to wipe out all life on Earth, and also because they tell us a lot about our solar system. One asteroid that caught many people's attention goes by the name of 1999 RQ36, and the reason people are so interested in this rocky body is because they think there's a pyramid on it. This structure has since become known as the Black Pyramid, and various people have shared their opinions on what they think the strange object is. Asteroid 1999 RQ36 was discovered back in September of 1999. It's estimated to measure in at just under 500 meters, and is even listed as being a potentially hazardous asteroid, meaning that at some point in the future it's going to crash into us or fly past at an extremely close distance. NASA said the following about the mission on their website. The mission will help scientists investigate how planets formed and how life began, as well as improve our understanding of asteroids that could impact Earth. NASA detects, tracks and characterizes asteroids and comets passing close to Earth using both ground and space-based telescopes. The Near Earth Object Observations Program at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory in Pasadena, California, commonly called Space Guard, discovers these objects, characterizes some of them, and plots their orbits to determine if any could be potentially hazardous to our planet. JPL manages the Near Earth Object Office for NASA's science mission in Washington. End quote. So what do NASA make of this strange looking pyramid that can be seen on the edge of this asteroid? As of right now, they haven't commented on the images. Something interesting to note though is that the images that show the pyramid were not taken by NASA, but rather were sent back from the Indian Space Research Organization. This has caused some to say that NASA edited their images in order to not show the pyramid, and that the reason they sent a mission to this asteroid was in order to investigate the pyramid. One UFO researcher said the following, We know that NASA has been editing their photographs for years, but I think this is one of the most interesting discoveries that's ever been made on an asteroid. It seems to me like they edited this image so you could no longer see the pyramid, and sent a mission there in order to go and investigate it. They made up the excuse that they wanted to get samples from the terrain of the asteroid, when all along they wanted to investigate this strange structure. It makes you wonder if they've been doing this with other solar bodies. End quote. Others went on to note that it's strange how NASA's and the Indian Space Research Organization's photographs don't match up, saying that either one of them is lying. Others have put forward more out their theories saying that this is proof that advanced life exists within the universe, but others have gone down a different route. Although they noted that the object does look a little strange, it doesn't mean that it's proof of pyramids or advanced life. They have said the object in question could be a shadow or even a case of pareidolia. One UFO researcher even said they tried to reach out to the Indian Space Organization, asking them what their thoughts were on the strange object. However, they said they never got a reply back. As of right now, not much information can be found about the strange object, and with NASA refusing to comment, it's only caused more other theories to be put forward. NASA have said there's various places of interest, and that we don't have to travel far to find possible life, as scientists and researchers have said that other complex life forms could actually be within our very own solar system. One place that's of particular interest is that of Jupiter's moon Europa. Due to this moon being of high interest, space agencies have said they want to send rovers to the planet and this is for the sole purpose of finding out if there's life in its vast ocean. Known as the Europa Lander mission, 
NASA scientists theorize that the most likely candidate for life to be found in our solar system is expected to be within the icy surface of Europa. Due to its expectation of the moon holding vast amounts of water beneath the frozen surface, Data surrounding Europa believes the moon holds a vast salty ocean of water, similar to our oceans on Earth. This giant ocean is said to span the moon's entire globe. Additionally, due to the frozen surface, scientists expect the conditions of the water to be favourable, as the ice surface acts as a natural atmospheric barrier against radiation, similar to our electromagnetic field giving life desirable conditions to flourish without its deep oceans. NASA plans on sending a rover to the moon in an attempt to penetrate the surface, and collect samples more than 4 inches deep to better understand the complex chemistry of materials from the ocean below. Efforts are already being made by NASA engineers to design a rover similar to the Martian rovers, that will carry miniature laboratories within the lander to analyse samples, but with the addition of an onboard chemical analysis lab, they would be able to hold microscopic cameras for the analysation of bacterial and microbial life. Although the project is still in its conceptual stages, it holds high promise in the search of extraterrestrial life, and seems to be of growing priority in the coming years. Interestingly, this isn't just fancy either. A British scientist has come forward and said it's almost a certainty that Jupiter's moon Europa is home to alien life, but they noted that these creatures could look similar to the octopus that we have on Earth. So what do you make of these interesting images? Do you think they show a pyramid-like structure, or do you think this is just a case of pareidolia, where people are seeing something that isn't actually there? Be sure to leave your questions and answers in the comments section below, and help us to grow this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.